way we go banter back and forth is something that evolved and it, yeah it comes closer to to tv comedy or something than doing your own than when i do my own stuff it's entirely different approach and, and doing this stuff with Eileen is very easy because i found that i could just feed her a lead line and she'd always come back with <laughs> something funny something you know and just pour it out you know, it's just like jewish comedy thing just pour out of her and and, and she, all she needed was a feed, you know, a feed line, and it was there. It was always there. In fact, sometimes I felt almost overwhelmed by it, and I felt that I had to uh, push me back, keep my place somehow, keep some, so she didn't completely dominate the whole thing. But sometimes I let her too, you know, it works. But it's I okay. need the feed line as much as I pour it out. I need that cue Usually from to, him. He, yeah. It's like George Burns and Grace Allen. He would feed her the line, and then she'd be hysterically funny. But, also I'd have but to without keep... that cue, it doesn't come out. But, yeah, so right. cue, it's the cue her. really makes it pour forth, makes time, it possible. I have to, I have to sometimes keep, yeah. keep you on the story, on the theme. Yeah. Or you're and not, from, God, from devouring you, which is how it is in real too, life, too. Not to get too drift away, not yeah. to drift into some other areas or yeah. into some other tangent. You know, I have to keep, okay, let's, let's keep, keep it me on focus. Yeah. yeah. But it's just like in real life, sometimes he has to run away from me or else I devour him. My energy will just envelop him and he'll just dissolve. His ego will dissolve into a thing. So he has to run away from me to recharge his ego so that he's not completely drained by me and the same thing in the story he has to like push me back that energy that I have but I'm grateful for it because I don't want to devour him thank you dear